This is Google in Mountain View, California. Home of the most extreme office perks in the country. We have everything you can imagine. Google really takes care of us. I'm much healthier and happier for it. And it all goes down at Google's main headquarters, AKA the Googleplex. One giant funhouse. When I first met the founders, I walked into our office and found Larry Page on rollerblades and Sergey Brin bouncing around on a physio ball. And I knew that this was no normal standard company. That's an understatement. Spanning over one million square feet, the Googleplex is two and a half times the size of Giant Stadium, comprised of 16 buildings which house the thousands of employees who are lucky enough to work here. And just like the campus, the perks are endless. If you open your eyes, it's hard to miss them. One of the most crowd-pleasing perks, that would be the food. Food here at Google is part of our culture. We have a variety of restaurants serving all sorts of different styles of food, from tapas, small plates, or ethnic foods, Indian to Asian to South American. That's right. Instead of your typical little lunchroom, Google has 18 different cafes serving breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The food is really incredible because there's so many options. And the best part? All the meals are free. That's right, free. What could be better than a free lunch? Free barbecue. In the summer, Google takes it outside for some serious grilling. But if that doesn't get your mouth watering, how about this? One of the cafes is called Cafe 150. Everything served there comes from within 150 miles of Google. It's all delicious, healthy, mostly organic, and locally grown food. And if eating locally is eco-friendly, Google takes it one step further, because they grow their own food right on campus. Our employees are excited with the cafe that says Google strawberries and uh, key lime Google pie. But even that's not enough free food for these employees. Because Google makes sure there are unlimited munchies within a few feet of everyone's desks. We're about, I don't know, 40 feet from where I sit at my desk. And unlike your average workplace, Google provides more than an old coffee pot and creamer. They hook it up fancy Java style. And oh yeah, it's all on the house. I get up from my desk quite a bit and make myself espresso to keep going. But if employees feel like they've had too much to eat, Google's got the perk to take care of it. Not one, not two, but four fully loaded gyms. And you guessed it, they're all free. Having the gym here at Google has been great for me because it's allowed me to train for two marathons. I've been much healthier and happier, and I definitely getting those lunch runs in has been perfect for getting back to work. It's made me so much more productive. And for those employees gunning for a six-pack, Google even has personal trainers on site. It's a great asset having personal trainers here. They really work one-on-one -on -one with you and help keep our workforce fit. After feeling the burn, there's only one thing left to do. Get a massage. Once a year on their birthdays, these lucky Googlers get a free rub down. Is there anything that's bothering you today? Neck, shoulders, back? Feeling sleepy after that? Employees can nap in sleeping pods while listening to some relaxing music. Still not enough TLC? There's also a doctor's office to take care of any aches and pains. Hi, I'm Dr. Razavi. How are you today? And of course, no doctor's bill. But Google doesn't just take care of their employees' bodies. The company also does their laundry. That's right. Google provides on-site laundromats for their employees' dirty clothes. You can show up for your day with a bag of laundry over your shoulders throw your laundry in our washroom area, go to work, and go home with your laundry done. Doing laundry at the office is a Google tradition. Founders Larry and Sergey have been pulling this act for years. They would work in this garage at a, the home of a friend. They would also do their laundry. The owner of the home used to complain they would cost her more money in utility bills than they were actually paying in rent. I just got out of work, I went to the gym, worked out for an hour, and now I'm here doing my laundry. How cool is that? Where else can you do this, right? Only at Google.
But even with all these amazing perks, sometimes Googlers want to leave the campus. And when they do, the company provides the wheels. And no, these aren't your average gas guzzlers. We have both plug-in Priuses and regular Priuses. So any employee that wants to check out a car and do some errands, they just have to use this really simple electronic key. And they zip away. And when they're done, they just plug the car back in, and then the car gets recharged. Free car? You better believe it. And when these lucky employees come back to Google after running some errands, there's only one place left to go. The sleeping pods. Hold up, we're not done. Because the Googleplex in Mountain View, California is just one of 68 other extreme Google workplaces around the world. First stop, Belo Horizonte, Brazil. Here, Google employees can grab a quick nap, not in a pod chair, but in one of four indoor hammocks. Next, Beijing, China. In the high-tech digs of Tsinghua Science Park, employees have their team meetings in beanbag chairs. And when it's break time, they're hanging out in one of ten micro-kitchens, playing ping-pong. But Google's most extreme international workplace has got to be... Zurich, Switzerland. Google created this engineering office with one thing in mind, to keep their 400 employees happy. So they brought in a psychologist to find out what would gratify these Googlers. And this is what they came up with. A lounge that houses exotic fish in an aquarium full of 1,850 liters of water to calm the minds of these hard workers. Then there's the Victorian library for a change of scenery, so these Googlers can feel like they've escaped the office on their coffee break. And when they want a little privacy, they can go into one of 100 different pods, with themes ranging from a Swiss chalet to an igloo satellite. Moving between floors, why take the stairs when there's this fire pole? That's right, a fire pole. And for their lunch break, these fun-loving employees wanted the quickest way to get to the cafeteria. The answer? This slide. Yep, at Google, the perks are out of this world, around the world.